Hello, and welcome to episode 5 of this YouTube series on Cities Skyline. Um, where we left off last time, uh, I just said that I was going to fill in this huge suburban town that we laid out the plans for. Um, we put down all the roads, uh, we started filling it in this bottom right corner here, and we'd added it in, like, the, we'd added in the bus depot, the hospital, some of the... Oh, pardon me, schools. Um... Uh, but yeah, we had some problems after, um, well I, I had some problems I should say, when I went, I carried on um, while was not streaming. In that, um, if you remember I shut off my water park in the industrial area here. Well, it turns out I'd accidentally zoned some industry down this road here where you see all these trees. And that like polluted the ground to no end. Uh, I don't think it's actually too bad now. Yeah, all the trees are kind of like soaking it all up, which is good. But I had to, I had to disconnect this from the mains. Like now, it's just in a little close circuit, and I had to quickly put in some pumps upstream and connect that in. Um, I could have gotten away with just using Utility Island, but I thought just in case the increased demand didn't quite hold up, I'd do it here. Um, and basically what happened was all my citizens started to drink dirty water and the healthcare just absolutely plummeted. It was ridiculous. Um, and then all, because the healthcare plummeted, um, those people died and my city, it shrank so much. Like all this was pretty much down and then it shrank back to just this corner. I've got it back up now, but. Yeah, it was a complete nightmare, and I also realised I hadn't put in any death care for this area, so I've got the advanced crematorium up here now that will su supply this area with what it needs to have. But, it, yeah, things weren't great for a while. Oh, we've still got... I don't think that's a... No, I thought that might be a remnant of what happened, but it, I don't think it is, which is good. <clears throat> but yeah, as you can see, our demand has gone up again. Um, we've got... <clears throat> pardon me, I don't know what's wrong with me today. Um, we've got some industry... We got industry demand, and like when I started to zone, like new factories started popping up, which is really good. So, I mean, we could probably do with a little bit more if I fill in this area, <laughs> making sure it's not near the water plant, obviously. Don't want to make that mistake again. Maybe put one on there one there and I'll just let them pop up naturally um so yeah it's going well now but we did have a bit of a problem there right so today uh, I really want to make this suburban area flourish and put in some cool features for it and one thing that I really want to do is I want it to access the main train line now, I thought a little bit about this, and obviously the train line to come here would have to go up the hill and make a bridge that might not look nice. Or I could have it tunnel through, but there's not really too much room to bring it up. Like, I could knock this out maybe, bring it up and then send it back down. Because I don't want loads of railway crossings in the middle of my suburban village, so... I had a little look on the asset store and I found this really good sunken um, train station. It's like, it's in, oh, let me rotate it. It's really good. I plonk one down. It's really, really nice. Um, like, the citizens just walk down the steps, uh, get their train, and the train's underground already, so that just shoots off. And it's just perfect for what I want it to do. Uh, now, you may have noticed I left this area blank, and that's because I want to put in um, these rail stations. And just for aesthetics purpose, I want to put in two. Like so. Um, oh, that's not actually... I might delete this road and extend it a little, because it's not quite the same length as that, I don't think. Let me just quickly check that. Uh, maybe we should have done this before we started. That's nine units. That's... 11 units, yeah, so they're not, I want to change that, um, i get rid of that, 
Um, I'll leave that how it is, but this one I'm going to change to, so where's nine units? Uh, oh, snap. That's nine. So I'll connect that there. Connect. Oh, it's, it's going to want to connect there. If I do this and then space already occupied, of course it is. Uh, I could make this a little curvy one. It's, it's the suburban area. It's not like a major thing if some or not all the roads are completely straight. Might be a bit annoying if you have OCD or anything. Uh, if you do, I severely apologize. Get rid of that. Okay, that'll be more uniform now. Oh, that's going to bug me, actually. Let's have a look. Because it's not, it doesn't go all the way. Yeah, that's no good. I'm just going to have it. Uh, straight road like that and then distance too short of course it is like so okay that's better and space already occupied there we go oh, I got worried then there so we've got like two sunken train stations off the main road now I prefer these to be on the main road, and I did try, like, I messed about with it a little bit before I started, and it just, it doesn't like connecting to four lane roads, you can't put them right adjacent to it, which is a bit of a shame, that would have been ideal really, um, so instead we're just going to fill in this bit, I don't know what we're going to fill it in with, but we'll fill it in with something. Um. What I'll just do quickly is rezone all this area. Have people move back in. After I messed about with their precious city and uh, just change that back to grass. Is that all still okay? That's still fine. Okay, so I'm not quite sure what I want to fill this with. An underground car park might be good. Being like a so like you can park up and then you can go do whatever. How's that look? Hmm, not completely sold on it. Let's see if we've got anything better. Obviously, we could just make it um like we just concrete up this entire area. Uh, I think it's a one by four. Just change, rotate that round. So that doesn't look very nice either, does it? I'm really not sure what I want to put here. Um. Huh. Problems. Let's have a look. At some of the other assets we might have. We've obviously got small parks. A lighthouse. Uh, not quite sure that'd fit in. Oh, what's this? Why won't you snap to there? Wait, let's have a look at it first. Oh, that, oh, that looks really good with it. That does look really good with it, actually. Oh, um, why, why won't you go on the this side? I've noticed that the zones are a little bit off as well. I don't know why that is. Oh, oh I did manage to get it for a second. No, space already occupied. I don't know what's in the way. Well, maybe for this one, if I put that down... Put that there. Does that work? It's annoying that it's not completely uniform. Have I got? I'm not sure. I didn't actually download that many car parks. 
But if I maybe just put down some... Do I have the freeform car park? Oh, this, these are all props. No, that doesn't really... I want something down here. I don't want it to be like... Huh. I really don't know what to put in. I think I'll just make this bit all commercial. I re the walkway fit fits in so well. I'm really annoyed that that won't fit in. Is it to be the road? Road looks identical. I know the zoning's different. I'm not sure what the cause of that is. Oh, what I think I'll do then is... Because that's going to bug me. If it's not... Okay, I think... Okay, I can live with that. That looks cool. And then this will eventually fill in with shops and stuff. Okay, yeah. I'm happy with that. That looks quite cool. And this, obviously, this is such a good um, tool for our citizens to join with main lines and stuff. So uh, I better actually do that. <laughs> um, let me get my railway and then page down. Um, page down again. Uh, I want these to... I want the two rails to join up into one, like, fairly early on. I mean, obviously they're underground, so it doesn't really matter. But I'll know, and you'll know, and we want it to look decent. Okay, so we've merged them into one. Now just to connect them to our main line over here. Uh, so there's a big cliff face. And um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have it come out that cliff face. So I might have to go down another level like that. And then like so, and then when it gets here, if I go, if I bring it back out. No, that's still a bit too high, isn't it? Right. Let's get rid of it. And try again. Um. There, that works. So it goes straight in and then straight to the stations. Yeah. That works. Now I need to connect it over there. Um, so if I bring it out, and then this road will extend, so... If I... I want it to curve and be almost perpendicular. And in fact, no, I don't like that. The road, the road should go over the railway and not the other way around, I think. Um, for a train to go like up a bridge and then back down again, I don't think that's quite how it'd work in real life. You want them to stay as level as possible. So if I do that, and then I can work my... I mean that might change at a later stage, but it's connected at the minute, which is good. So yeah, now I've got two nice train lines here. I like that. And what I, um, what I could do... Oh no, there's not much... Yeah, I'll make one train line... Because um, I've got one for my... This this um, seaside town and my industry. So that one will continue all the way through. And that'll go to like the left one or something. And then go all the way back, but this right-hand one will just go from there straight to the seaside town and straight back. That sounds like a good idea to me. Um, so I don't, I don't actually know how to extend lines. Alright, I'll just have to get rid of it. Okay, so my first... So the first line, this will be my industry one, 
So add a stop. And then I think I said the right hand. It doesn't really matter, but it'll go there. And then stop on your way back through. And go back up and complete your line. And then because we've got multiple platforms, I might as well use a different platform. And then this one will go straight through to this. And then obviously when our big city is done, um, it will also, we'll make it go right through there as well. There we go. So they should hopefully start soon. Let's let's. Um, oh, can't catch it. There we go. And let's watch it fly through. Goes over the bridge. Goes across into the tunnel. Lovely. I like that. Okay, so yeah, that now they're connected up. That's that should be really, really useful. Uh, people are using it, yeah. People are definitely. Oh, look at all the people using it. That's insane. And is anyone even bothering to use this one? I don't think they are. Oh wait, I saw some someone down. Is that person just walking on the train tracks? That's just not really sensible at all, is it? Don't do that, children. Right. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I want to add my uh, a bus, a new bus route, um, in my suburban town. So I've got one going clockwise. I want one to go anti-clockwise, and I need. I'd like quite like a central one. So maybe I'll just should, maybe I should just do one that starts here. I remember we're left-hand driving, so. Maybe that's not the best place to start. Alright, I'll make this a short loop, I think. So it'll stop in nearly all the same places, just on the other side of the road. Um, yeah, stop outside there. 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 There, but instead of carrying on, we'll go here. Oh, this might be silly. Is this a silly idea? Oh no. That won't cause too much issue, I don't think. <clears throat> Hopefully this... I can't see these two roads being particularly popular. Or maybe the arc is coming it. Hmm. It's like... A, I don't think there's a single lane bus thing. No, there wasn't. We'll have to see. We'll have to keep an eye on that and see how that goes. Um, but other than that, I'm fine. Uh, the people up here, they can always get. I've got free public transport on my policies, I think. Yeah, so they can always just grab a bus to like here, and then another bus to the station, and then the station to wherever they need to go. There's one coming in now. People are using this one, but this one definitely seems to be the favourite. Uh, look at the amount of people using it. I'm really happy with that. <clears throat> right, I don't... There's a bit of... I might put a park in here. We've got a bit of a empty space. I don't want that. Um, da -da -da -da. An athletic track, maybe. Small playground. Lots of trees. A small park. Mm. How's that? Yeah? Sure. Uh, oh, I want residential. I need to. They really want residential now, don't they? I uh, don't want to put. I don't want to clog this junction up too much as it's the main way in. Although we do have. A lot of people are using it actually. Uh, whereas before they were just using this little road. Maybe that's because like on from this side it's easier to go along the highway. Where do you uh oh he's going to the university. It's quite a trek for you. Oh where are you working at the nuclear plant. He's going to the organic food market. Where's that? He's going all the way over here. Wow. 
If he's vegan, he must be dedicated. Right. Um, what shall I do now? Uh, we've got a few empty spaces. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to spend the rest of this episode sprucing up this roundabout. Um, we want to make it look pretty. It's like the centerpiece of our little town, so... I'm going to have... I'll have a nice... I'm going to have a... <clears throat> a cement path snaking through the middle. Like so. Then another one from this side that goes like that way. Like that. And then little gravel ones coming off of it. How does this look? Uh, another one over here. Um, how's that? That's the location. It looks a bit like a basketball or a football or something, doesn't it? Um, how in the middle? I think I'm gonna have a nice like rock collection, maybe. <laughs> Look at that. I like that big rock. That big rock's awesome. And then maybe just like a another few dotted about. Don't want them all to be the same. Like that. And then trees galore. I just said. So let's have loads going oh I don't want that tree that's bloody tiny oh yeah trees galore going around the outside oh, I find it, like these little ones keep spawning I don't know why oh come on give me a big one there we go there's so many little ones spawning Um, let's mix it up a little bit. I want big trees. There we go. Just for a bit of variety. Don't want every tree to be the same. Oh, they're nice and big. I like that. Okay. Right, and then some bushes. Like... Around here, and in between our rocks, just like lining up the center. I thought I might throw one or two um, big trees in the middle as well. Uh, maybe on this side. What else have we got? We plop you there. Yeah, that looks really good. Uh, still some empty space. These ah, get some small bushes in there. I might paint these in. Oh no, that was a silly idea. Like, like that. Just get loads in. Ah, oh, this is a lovely little park. Lots some more down here. And fill in the gaps here. Tell you what, I like the look of this. That's a lovely centerpiece, isn't it? Now this look, because of all how bare it is around, it looks a bit silly. But I think yeah, we should definitely, because I don't really want any buildings on the like outskirts of our main roundabout. Oh, I wish the small trees had stopped spawning. Let's make a nice variety. 
And then obviously, right, I'm just going to go around now and then change the trees up and follow it around. Keep going around the circle. And this. I really do like that centerpiece though. I think that's really cool. Ouch. Um, now, as for the mid, yeah, it's still just a bit too green. Um, but this bit I'll definitely be filling in with, I'll put in commercial there. And then put uh, commercial there too. There and there, that'll fill those gaps in a little bit, and that's going to be commercial as well. Um, yeah, uh, maybe just fill in like this area with a few. And then, down, what is that car doing? And then just, let's just to clear up some of those blank green spaces that we don't want. I'm sure once the commercial buildings actually fill in, that might look a lot better. Uh, but yeah, the centerpiece is stunning, if I do say so myself. Uh, yeah, fantastic. Um, so I think I might leave it there for today then. Um, I'll have a think about what I want to do next, but it's looking likely that um, I'll make the transport hub here. Uh, if you don't know what the plan is. Uh, this big road, this road is going to extend all the way into the big city that's going to be built around here. Um, so this, I want this to be the hub between suburbia and the big city. Um, and I want the big city to be like tram lines and subways and things like that. So I might make this like the transport hub. So where they all spawn from. Um, connections between the bus route we've got going on and the subway slash tram line um, and then it just makes it easier for citizens to get about and obviously I want to continue this railway through and into the city as well and um, yeah I'll have a think about what I want to do next time and thank you very much for watching I'll see you soon bye